Hey guys, welcome back. So today I wanted to do a quick haul video for the new Fortnite Jazzwares 4-inch line action figures. So all of these were released today as of December 1st. So if you're watching this video, that means they are out to the general public. Um, so I have the entire wave except for Bandolier. Unfortunately, that was the only one I was unable to get a hold of. Um, so before we get into looking at all the figures, I just want to let everybody know where these figures were at. So I was able to get the line at, uh, like the entire line, except for Bandolier, at Target, and then with one exclusive um, at uh, GameStop. So the first one we'll take a look at is uh, the solo figures right off the bat. So again, unfortunately, without Bandolier here, there should be six. So the first one we're going to take a look at is, uh, is Drift. Uh, so this was the one that was actually tweeted out by Jazzwares about a week ago, um, kind of showcasing their figures and what they were about to do. Uh, Drift comes in his like, you know, his um, most, you know, his ultimate uh, costume once you max it out, um, and then his really nice freaking um, harvesting tool. On the back shows just, I mean, some nice little figure art and then uh, other figures in the wave. This went for twelve ninety nine uh, at my local Target. Um, along with all the solo mode figures. So the basic figure line, and as you see, it comes with his harvesting tool and then a piece of a wall, this portion right here. It's a piece of a building material. Um, and we'll go into that in a second. Um, these basic figures go for $12.99. So additionally with Drift, there is Raptor, which is probably my favorite figure out of the wave. Uh, I mean, it's just, this is my favorite, you know, favorite skin to use in game. Um, really nice harvesting tool as well. He comes with another portion of the wooden style um, wall piece. Uh, nice packaging. So I think one of the things that I really like about this line and what they did with um, their packaging is they used clamshells. So if you guys are Joe collectors, um, these are very reminiscent of that. Literally same scale. Articulation looks to be about the same as well. Um, so this is a nice replacement since uh, G.I. Joe's from Hasbro are no longer really being made. Um, so, you know, again, when I saw these, I just got really excited about it and uh, very, very excited about it. Um, just give you kind of a close up too on his paint apps. I mean, they did a really, really good job on these figures. So again, this figure was $12.99 along with that, you know, drift. Next one up is Carbide. So Carbide comes and it's kind of like, a, it looks like his upper armor and lower armor, um, you know, has been um, like, maxed out, but they didn't use the upgraded helmet on him, which is kind of a bit of a disappointment. Um, so same backing as the other ones, uh, only difference is there's a different color back on the, you know, so this one's orange, obviously. It comes with this nice harvesting tool, another piece of that wooden, um, you know, wall material. Really great paint application on the figure itself. So again, this was, because it's solo mode, $12.99. Uh, the other one that I got on the solo mode was Technique. Technique has a really nice harvesting tool, another similar piece of the um, wooden building material, and then her paint application, which looks really, really good. I think they did a really good job on this figure. So she's got purple backing and on the backside, similar to Drift. You know, they have kind of, it looks like two, two of each figure has the same backing. But uh, sorry for the glare. With this clamshell, it's kind of hard to uh, not get that glare involved. And so all those figures were $12.99. The next one we're gonna take a look at is Omega. So um, Omega, there were less of these um, in stock when I picked these up earlier this morning. Uh, and the reason why is that, so this is, I guess, a step up from their uh, basic figure line. So this is their early game survival kit. So as you can tell, Omega actually comes with more than just his harvesting tool. So he comes with his harvesting tool, he comes with his back bling, he comes with a really nice glider. Um, and this is the only glider that I've seen so far released. Um, another piece of the building material, and then he's got the Siege Breaker, um, for those of you that play, you know, Save the World, or just the really nice legendary AR uh, for Battle Royale. Um, besides the fact that he, you know, has additional accessories, everything on the back looks very similar to those solo modes. The only difference with this figure, uh, he, I'll give you guys a close up while I'm explaining to you. Um, he was $19.99. So he was a little more expensive, uh, to get the additional accessories with him having that, you know, early game survival kit, but I would definitely say it's worth it. Um, 
the you know the accessories that it comes with is really nice. Um, I picked up one of these treasure chests, so these go for nine uh, nine ninety nine. There's like six of them in the first wave, and they all come with different stuff. So I'll try to read it off to you. I don't know if the plastics. Um, blocking that. So this comes with the rust bucket back bling. So this is for Rust Lord. You get the drum gun, scoped assault rifle, the thermal scoped assault rifle, the tactical submachine gun, and two more of the building material. It's undetermined whether that's going to be brick, metal, or wood. Um, so the next thing that I was able to pick up was the Loot Drama Llama Pinata. So this was, it's kind of, let's see if I can get the whole thing in. Uh, frame. I can't apologize for that. It's, it's huge. So this was uh, $24.99 um, And this comes with a bunch of accessories. So this comes with what is this? Uh, yeah, 23 pieces. Uh, it has the Rust Lord figure. It comes with an assault rifle, a rocket launcher, legendary assault rifle, bolt action sniper rifle, legendary burst assault rifle, suppressed submachine gun, light machine gun, drum gun, pump shotgun, grenade launcher, a scaly, kettle bow, a satchel, bright bag, and then eight more building materials uh, that are exclusive for this llama um, that differ from the different ones. And I, I can explain that also in a second uh, once we get done looking at everything. So the four pack or the squad mode, this is probably one of my most exciting or excited uh, sets. I'm trying to get that glare out of the way uh, that I was really looking forward to. So this comes with Rex, Cuddle Team Leader, the Bright Bomber, and then, of course, Raggedy Rock in all of his glory in that finished, leveled-up skin. Um, they all come with their traditional pickaxes or their harvesting tools, and then included with that, they also come with um, five weapons. So you got the dual pistols up top, scoped assault rifle, scoped sniper rifle, and then one of those legendary tactical heavy shotguns. Uh, on the back, uh, similar, um, just, you know, artwork seen like the uh, the solo ones a little bit different it's got a cardboard backing to it uh that's showing and then on the bottom it shows the other figures in line so again rust lord comes in that loot llama and then bandolier drift raptor and carbide technique they are all the uh solo mode figures omega is that early game survival kit and then jonesy and uh raven come in a two pack so this set i found it at target this is the only place i found like i was able to find it was at target and this went for 39.99 which is you know, when you think about it, pretty reasonable given the fact that the basic cart, you know, basic clamshell figures are going for twelve ninety nine. So you're actually getting a better deal uh, with more figures, more accessories, and more guns at a lower price. Um, so last one up in the wave that I was able to pick up. So this was, I think, in the U.S. and I could be wrong. And if I am wrong, please leave a comment explaining where you guys found this. So I went to a bunch of stores today um, trying to find this set. And so the only place that I was able to find have it here in the US was GameStop. Um, now, while I was doing my you know research for this set, um, you know, I came across a lot of the European and UK sites, and it looks like that smell uh, this set is selling at a bunch of locations in the UK. I think at Smith's, at Toys R Us, um, at some of their other retail stores. Unfortunately, you know, my targets, my Walmarts that I went to, none of them were carrying this. The only place that did carry this was GameStop, and they had literally out of like the five GameStops that I called, one of them had it in stock. So I was really fortunate with that. Um, this is probably my favorite set, and I know it sounds kind of silly. Uh, Jonesy is my favorite skin. I know in Battle Royale, it's no skin, but in Save the World, um, the survivalist Jonesy uh, character, uh, you know, he's, he's, he's my boy. He's my favorite guy to play with once you get them all, uh, maxed out and tiered up. Um, so the set comes with Raven and Jonesy. Uh, their accessories are that tactical pump shotgun, the suppressed submachine gun. It looks like a hunting rifle and then like a rare, and I think this is kind of a little bit weird. So the color variations on the figure or on the guns have to do with the rarity, um, to the gun. So I, I'm assuming with the blue, that's their, blue rare hunting rifle and that rare revolver and what's pretty slick about this set is so this is actually their their first building set so it comes with um 81 building materials and so how these building materials work is that they you know you can see them up in the top right um similar to what the figures have too they have a portion of what it takes to build a wall and so a wall takes four pieces you know they're they're two by two essentially and then they're configured that way and you can do a whole bunch of different things with it uh, they look really slick. Uh, they look really nice um, once you have enough building accessories. And here's some of the, the different things that you can do with it. 
Uh, you can build a llama out of it. Uh, here, this is showcasing the different uh, building materials that this set comes with. So it's got 27 wood pieces, 27 brick pieces, and then 27 metal building material pieces. Um, and then it you know, has that really nice display art of the two figures. Um, so I just you know wanted to put this out there because I've been seeing a crazy amount of eBay listings and third-party prices uh, pricing these figures at like $300 to $400 for the entire wave, which is absolutely crazy. Do not buy those things. Do not let scalpers push you guys to buy that kind of stuff. Um, it's looking like right now a lot of the stores, a lot of the retail stores that carry toys are having these in stock. Uh, I will say with probably this building set, this is going to be the hardest one to find given the exclusivity to, you know, I believe GameStop. Um, when I looked online, it wasn't available for online purchase. And, you know, it took me a while to get the, um, you know, the store associate to look in the back because it wasn't in their computer, even though it showed up on the website that they did have it. So there was kind of a little bit of a, a weird delay on that. So I would say probably out of the set, this is gonna be the hardest one to find, um, but it is there and this was uh, $39.99. Uh, so it was same price as the four pack. And you know, I guess when it comes to, um, is it worth it? You know, it's gonna depend on, you know, obviously who you are, why you're collecting it. And um, you know, I'm a, I'm a huge Fortnite Save the World and Battle Royale fan. I love the skins. Uh, I'm a huge Joe collector, you know, and unfortunately Joes are gone now. So this is a great way to kind of continue that line of the three and three quarter inch figures with a, a, a unique twist to it of having the building material, um, different kind of uh, art. So these are definitely a lot more cartoonish than a lot of the Joes, but the figures are very well done. Um, you know, they all have 19 points of articulation. Uh, the paint applications do not look... Um, messy you know they jazz wares, uh if you're unfamiliar with them they do uh you know obviously they're more more known ones are you know roblox but they also did the uh the mortal Kombat figures you know back a few years ago that you know in the four inch line so they're very familiar with this line with articulation and they do a great job with it um you know and i gotta say i cannot recommend these figures more than you know <laughs> showing you these they're they're amazing um i'm gonna do you know, each individual unboxing and reviews of all of them. There's just too many of them to do all in one video because it's already getting long. So I'm going to cut this, you know, right here. Just wanted to show you guys what's out there, what's available in stores. So definitely check your targets, check your Walmarts, check your GameStops. These figures are out there and do not pay the outrageous eBay prices. They all released straight date of December 1st. So at, if you're watching this video, they are out there. Um, go get them. If you guys do find this turbo building sex, I would love to get another one of these. You find them elsewhere at GameStop. Please leave a comment where you guys found that because that'd be really good info to have. Um, besides that, guys, I hope you liked the video. If you did like the video, please leave a like. If you guys aren't subscribed, think about subscribing. Uh, and besides that, guys, I hope you have a great day. Happy hunting.